Good afternoon. On behalf of the Norris Board of Education, staff, and administration, I would like to welcome you to the Norris Virtual Seniors Honor Convocation. The word unprecedented has been used a great deal recently. Whether young or old, none of us have experienced anything like what life has been like the past few months. It has reminded us that school is more than a building and community is more than a place. Collectively, you've reminded us what it means to be Norris, even in unparalleled circumstances. Thank you. Seniors, we know this is not the end of the year you imagined. While so much looks different in your personal lives with this event, and as you near the end of your senior year, it does not diminish what we are here to recognize and celebrate today. You're an impressive group. You've excelled in the classroom, performed with distinction, competed with class, and have provided positive leadership for your school. You're the best of the best, and you've made us proud. The scholarships you'll be awarded today are much more than the financial support and distinction they provide. They signify a commitment to personal excellence, a desire to push yourself to new heights, and they underscore the tremendous potential with which you end your senior year and begin the next phase of your journey. The qualities you had to embody in order to earn them are what will endure and serve you throughout the rest of your personal and professional lives. To our parents and faculty, the accomplishments of these students honor you as well. They would not be here today without your patience, guidance, and loving support. A special thank you to the Norris Schools Foundation and those that have given generously to support these scholarship awards. Your contributions and support open doors and cultivate new opportunities for Norris students. Seniors, congratulations once again, and thank you for letting us be a part of your journey. I'll now turn the program over to Mr. Sagerman. Thank you. Norris High School annually recognizes students who have shown consistent dedication to and achievement of academic excellence through academic, the academic lettering program. The academic letter is awarded to students in their sophomore through senior years who have maintained a cumulative grade point average of 3.75 or higher through their third, fifth, and seventh semesters of high school. Historically, this award has been bestowed based on each student's performance in core content areas only. But for the second year now, we have included all academic areas in order to acknowledge the unique strengths and interests of our diverse student population. It is my pleasure to recognize the following students whose perseverance and dedication to learning has earned them a Norris High School academic letter. Our next award is the Presidential Excellence Award. Students who have achieved a cumulative grade point average of 3.5 or higher and scored in the 85th percentile or higher for both math and reading are eligible to receive this award. This year's recipients are Samuel Benning, Lanowit Beaumont, Max Christensen, Anastasia Davis, Hunter DeBoer, Reagan Hesterman, Riley Hesterman, Sydney Hobza, Jackson Joan, Genoa Jurgens, Morgan Kaler, Cashel Martin, Rowan Ulmer, Samantha Palermo, Connor Price, Jackson Savage, Jacob Schilling, Emma Severson, Jacob Starr, Julia Stevenson, Hadley Susie, Noah Van Brocklin, Zachary Van Brocklin, J.C. Wallstrom, Luke Whipple, and Chan Susieman. At this time, I would like to recognize this year's recipients of the Principal's Award of Excellence. In order to earn this award, seniors must have maintained a 4.0 cumulative grade point average throughout the first seven semesters of their high school career. It is my great pleasure to announce this year's recipients of the Principal's Award of Excellence. Max Christensen, Hunter DeBoer, Cagney Ellers, Riley Hesterman, Sydney Hobza, Genoa Jurgens, Morgan Kaler, Grace Munson, Rowan Ulmer, Samantha Palermo, Connor Price, Christopher Richardson, Jackson Savage, Jacob Schilling, 
Emma Severson, Jacob Starr, Julia Stevenson, Hadley Susie, Noah Van Brocklin, Zachary Van Brocklin, Luke Whipple, Aaron Williams, and Chanice Z. Our next award is the first of many external honors that our seniors have earned this year. This one is the Omaha World Herald All Academic Program. Students in the Omaha World Herald All Academic Program were in the top 4% of all graduating seniors in the state of Nebraska. The top two students ranked in their class, as well as any student that scored a 32 or above on the ACT, were nominated. The following students from Norris were nominated based on these criteria. Lanowet Beaumont, Troy Bayman, Riley Hesterman, Genoa Jurgens, Cashel Martin, Connor Price, Jacob Schilling, Emma Severson, Jacob Starr, Julia Stevenson, Zach Van Brocklin, and Chanice Zeman. All of these students earned honorable mention and will receive a certificate in their honors convocation packet during senior checkout. In addition to these honorable mentions, it is my great pleasure to announce that Samantha Palermo and Hunter DeBoer earned a spot on the Omaha World Herald All Academic First Eastern Team, and Jackson Savage earned a spot on the Omaha World Herald All Academic Second Eastern Team. Congratulations to Samantha, Hunter, Jackson, and all of these students for their outstanding academic achievement. The Academic Wall of Honor acknowledges the highest caliber of academic achievement. Graduating seniors who have met the most rigorous academic requirements that Norris offers will have their name and picture added to the Wall of Honor at the east end of the main hallway. To be eligible for the Academic Wall of Honor, seniors must meet the following criteria. Be in the top 5% of the graduating class, earn a minimum score of a 32 on the ACT or 1350 on the SAT, and achieve one or more of the following, National Merit Scholar, Presidential Scholar, Century 3 Scholar, National Honor Society Scholar, Bird Scholarship Recipient, Omaha World Herald Academic All-State Recipient. This year, it is my great pleasure to announce that we have three students who have earned this academic honor. Hunter DeBoer, for an ACT of 35 and the top 5% of his graduating class, additionally a National Merit Scholar, and Omaha World Herald Eastern First All-American State Team. Samantha Palermo, ACT of a 35, top 5% of her graduating class, and Omaha World Herald Eastern First All-Academic State Team. And Jackson Savage, 36 on the ACT, top 5% of graduating class, Omaha World Herald Eastern Second All Academic State Team. Congratulations to Hunter, Samantha, and Jackson on this tremendous achievement. Be sure to look for their picture the next time you're in the building. The next award is the Regent Scholarship and other full tuition scholarships. The UNL Regent Scholarship is one of the top scholarship awards offered by the University of Nebraska system and provides full tuition for students. It is a very competitive selection process where students who receive at least a 30, and in most cases even higher, on their ACT, and also hold a high class ranking are considered. We want to recognize students who earn UNL's Regent Scholarship or any other full tuition merit-based scholarship from any other college or university. Normally we would ask at this time for students who received a Regent or full tuition scholarship to stand and be recognized, but since we can't see you, we'll keep moving right along. These students have worked hard to earn this top academic award, and you will hear their names, specific scholarships offered, and the school sponsoring full tuition read along with all of their individual scholarships through the next portion of our program. Our next award is the Titan Award Recipient Award. Titan Awards are given to student athletes in recognition of their participation in 12 sports during their high school career. Students will be given a plaque and have their names added to the Titan Award winners of the past to be displayed in the high school's main hallway. This year's recipients are Aiden Order, Connor Price, and Taryn Tracy. Our next award is the Athletic Excellence Award. This award is given to any athlete who has earned 60 points or greater throughout their athletic career at Norris High School. Points can be earned through letter winner, EMC all-conference or top half of individual medals, 
EMC honorable mention or bottom half of individual medals, state qualifier, team or individual, super state or state champion, first team all state or individual state runner up, second team all state or individual medal, medal winner in remaining top half, Honor, honorable mention all state or individual medal winner in bottom half, academic hall conference, Lincoln Journal Star Academic All State, and NSAA Academic All State. This year's Athletic Excellence Awards are given to honor, it, honor the athletic careers of Ashton Hausman, Aiden Order, Olivia Ozenbaugh, Samantha Flamero, Connor Price, Ethan Schmidt, Taryn Tracy, and Zach Van Brocklin. The next award is the Athletic Wall of Fame inductees. To receive an Athletic Wall of Fame recognition at Norris High School, a student athlete must be recognized and awarded one of the following. First team All-State Award by Lincoln Journal Star, Omaha World Herald for the Nebraska Coaches Association. A state champion in any individual sport. The following student athletes have been recognized on the Athletic Wall of Fame. Dylan Meyer in football, Aiden Order in football, Olivia Ozenbaugh in softball, Molly Ramsey in volleyball, Zach Van Brocklin in cross country, Ella Waters in volleyball, and Alexis Wiggins in softball. Our next award is the Fine Arts Wall of Fame Inductee Award. To be an inductee on the Fine Arts Wall of Fame, a student must, must meet the following criteria. Recipient of the John P. Souza Award for Band or the Louis Armstrong Award for Jazz Band. Selection into the All-State Band, Orchestra, or Jazz Band at least two years or another equally prestigious state, regional, or national band. Selection into three honor bands that require an audition. Recipient of at least three superior ratings for Elkhorn Band Olympics and or the District Music Contest for solo performances. This year's recipient of the Fine Arts Wall of Fame is Lanouette Beaumont for instrumental music. Our next award is the Norris Alumni Basketball Scholarship this is supported by the Alumni Basketball tournament, tournament held annually. Despite the cancellation of the 22nd annual tournament, this year many alumni still donated to support the scholarship, proving the lasting impact of and commitment to the boys basketball program at Norris High School. It is awarded to students who participated or contributed to the Norris boys basketball program, are ranked in the top half of their graduating class, and plan to attend an accredited college in the fall of 2020. This year's recipients of the scholarship are Gage Kircher, Aiden Order, and Connor Price. The Norris Athletic Booster Scholarship is to recognize the great community support athletics that Norris has. The Norris Athletic Booster Scholarship recognizes student athletes that are Titan Award winners, ranked in the top half of their graduating class, and plan to attend an accredited college. This year's recipients of the Norris Athletic Booster Scholarship are Aiden Order, Connor Price, and Taryn Tracy. The Chad Coho Memorial Scholarship was established in honor of Chad Coho, a Norris graduate and an active member of the baseball community, a playing and coaching many teams during his life. Scholarship criteria asks for participation in Norris Boys baseball program for at least three of the four years and a minimum, minimum of a 3.0 GPA. This year's recipient, Connor Price, is extra special as he not only meets the criteria but also happens to be Chad's nephew. The next award is the Norris Student Council Scholarship Award. It is special in that it is chosen by the student council underclassmen and recognizes a member that has made many contributions to their organization. 
Applicants must be a member of student council and write an essay discussing student council's benefit to their life. This year's recipients are Sophia Miller and Chanacy Zeman. The Norris Leadership Scholarship is sponsored by the Norris Student Council and recognizes a senior that has shown exceptional leadership. The student is nominated by a Norris teacher and must carry at least a 3.5 GPA and plan to attend an accredited college or university. This year's recipient is Hunter DeBoer. The Norris Instrumental Scholarship is sponsored by the Norris Band Booster Program. It recognizes a student who actively participated in the study of music in high school and will attend an accredited two or four year college or university. This year's recipient is Lanawet Beaumont. Now it's my pleasure to introduce Mr. David Dudley, Norris Foundation board member. Sorry, these really suck. Okay. Seniors, senior parents, this really sucks. We're sitting here in an empty auditorium, awarding scholarships, uh, awarding all kinds of other things, and darn it, you're not here. It sucks. I'm David Dudley. I'm here on behalf of the Norris Educational Foundation Board. Um, I'm pleased to be here, uh, even though you are not. Uh, I'm especially pleased because today, for the first time since St. Patty's Day, I shaved. It's pretty exciting. Found a couple of new wrinkles. In addition, uh, for the first time since St. Saint, Saint, Saint Patty's Day, um, I put some deodorant on. My wife appreciated the fact that I had to get up in the morning, shave, put on some deodorant, and come here. Sorry, you're not here. Um, the Norris Educational Foundation Board has been around since the, the early 1980s. And what we do is we raise money and we give money away. Most of the money that we raise and give away is for scholarships. And that's what I'm here to do today, is to give away some scholarships to deserving Norris seniors. Um, normally, uh, an exciting part of, of the presentation is getting a chance to meet and see uh, seniors who have excelled and are moving on with their lives. Again, sorry, this sucks. Um, this past year, we lost a couple of very important people to the Norris family um, that I think we need to mention. Uh, first, a uh, longtime teacher and coach, Ron Severson, passed away. Um, Ron uh, uh, was, was instrumental in getting the wrestling program started at Norris. Uh, when I attended his funeral, my wife and I sat in the back and we could watch people we didn't know and identify those folks as wrestler, yeah, wrestler, wrestler. Um, Ron and his, or Ron's family, uh, Pat and his family have generously donated some money uh, for a scholarship that we'll be talking about later. The other person that we lost this past year um, has been on the Norris Foundation Board since its inception. Um, this particular individual was probably the quintessential Norris cheerleader. And I'm speaking, of course, of Larry Grosshands. Uh, Larry was a longtime Norris administrator. Larry was uh, on uh, the school board for the last uh, many years and also served uh, in many different capacities, uh, raising money, doing all sorts of things for Norris and the Norris community. Um, traditionally, the last 15 years, Larry and I were the ones that had the privilege of handing out awards, scholarships. Um, it was a little bit of a dog and pony show. Um, I would make jokes about how old Larry was, make a reference to him trying to find Sputnik orbiting with his binoculars, or suggest that uh, he might have been one of the last few folks that played football without a face mask. And in turn, Larry would turn around and make kind of lame attorney jokes. Um, we miss Larry. Um, we miss Larry's uh, contributions on the board. Um, we certainly were going to miss uh, just seeing and being with Larry. Um, 
Larry uh, on the board was instrumental in helping raise money. Uh, he's been in charge of the golf tournament, the Titan, uh, Titan Twister, as it's been known since the tornado, and uh, spent a lot of time raising money, uh, a lot of time doing things for the board, for the Norris community. Um, when Larry was uh, trying to come up with ideas to, to raise money, oh, about 10 years ago, when we were, we were involved in a capital camp, uh, fundraising campaign, he decided that what he would try to do is convince people to buy life insurance policies, small life insurance policies that had very little premium. And then the idea was to, to then designate the foundation as the beneficiary of the policy. Uh, as far as I know, Larry was the only one who did that. Again, Larry continues to give even after. What uh, I'm here to do today is to, is to award the scholarships that are given through the foundation. Um, the foundation works with many generous donors who have given money through the foundation. Uh, those of you who have interest in donating uh, for scholarships or any other uh, um, uh, need that Norris has, feel free to go ahead and get on to the website and you can find a way of donating money, giving it through the foundation. Uh, to the extent you need uh, a tax break, there are options, talk to your accountant. The first scholarship we want to award today is uh, the director scholarship. The first couple of scholarships we're going to award are based on some criteria that have been identified by both the board and uh, Norris administration and counseling staff. Um, uh, the, the folks that apply for these scholarships uh, have their um, uh, academic achievement considered. We also take into consideration their activities. We also get recommendations from staff. That information is then compiled by the, the counseling staff. Thank you all. And from that, uh, from those criteria, we make uh, determinations as uh, with respect to who's going to be awarded the scholarships. The first scholarship we give is we call it the director's scholarship. Um, and it is based on those criteria. And it is for $2,000 scholarships that are awarded uh, to each to a Norris male and female student. This year's recipient of the Director's Fund Scholarship are Hunter DeBoer, Jacob Starr, Samantha Palermo, and Riley Hesterman. Congratulations to all four of you. The next scholarship that is awarded uh, through these criteria uh, is what we refer to as the Founders Scholarship. Uh, and we give out uh, this year eight scholarships of $1,000 each uh, to four Norris male students and four female students. This year's recipients of the Founders Scholarship, which is $1,000 each, is Colton Johnson, Gage Kircher, Chris Richardson, uh, Sydney Hobza, Julia Stevenson, Luke Whipple, Hadley Susie, and Chenesee Zeman. Congratulations to all of you. The next scholarship, which is also based on the same criteria uh, I referenced earlier, uh, is the PTO scholarship. And the PTO is, uh, the, the money raised is raised by the PTO, traditionally uh, by the, uh, the old elementary carnival. Uh, this year, uh, the PTO has generously donated $2,000 for four scholarships. Uh, this year's recipients are Connor Price, J.C. Wallstrom, Grant Franken, and Emma Severson. Congratulations to all four of you. The next scholarship that the Foundation awards is the Baker Scholarship. The Baker Scholarship was established in honor of Ed Baker, who some years ago now was an English teacher here at Norris. Uh, I can remember going to uh, meet Mr. Baker at parent-teacher conferences, and uh, I always found Mr. Baker to be a very interesting, intelligent uh, man. Uh, his family, after, after Mr. Baker's uh, unfortunate, untimely death, uh, has set aside a very generous gift, uh, which we have benefited from in the last 15 years. Uh, the Baker Scholarship is awarded to applicants who have an interest and involvement in the area of language arts, including English, drama, speech, or journalism. The applicants submit uh, writing samples and so that, that uh, are reviewed not only by the English staff here at Norris, but also uh, by the uh, Ed Baker family. 
This year, we're awarding four scholarships from the Baker Fund, uh, $750 each. And the recipients of the Baker Scholarship this year are Grace Lynn Adams, Hunter DeBoer, Gage Kircher, and Riley Husterman. Congratulations to all four of you. The next scholarship that's offered through the foundation is the Dorothy Barron's Memorial Scholarship, DOT, to all the folks that knew DOT. Um, the scholarship is given uh, priority for the, the applicants who are looking at majoring in elementary education uh, are given priority. Uh, DOT was a longtime uh, Norris teacher and uh, substitute teacher. This year, the DOT Barron's Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Carly Cohoe. The next scholarship uh, is a new scholarship for the foundation, and it was established in memory of, of, memory of Larry Grosshands. Uh, the family, Larry's family, Janet, and, and the balance of the family uh, wanted preference given to applicants who do plan on pursuing a career in education or special education. Um, the applicants were uh, required to submit uh, responses to some essay questions and then obtain recommendation letters from staff. The uh, Gross Hands Scholarship uh, is two scholarships, $1,500 each. This year, the recipients of the Gross Hands Scholarship for the first time are Cadence Broderson and Jacob Starr. Congratulations to both of you. The next scholarship um, that is awarded through the foundation uh, is from a generous gift from uh, the folks at Gina, and um, it has the, the important criteria for the folks at Gina is to identify someone with an entrepreneurial mindset, someone who thinks uh, about business, thinks about uh, about generating business. Um, those applicants are required to respond to questions regarding their career goals and their vision. Uh, this year's recipient of the $1,000 Gaina Scholarship is Colton Johnson. Congratulations, Colton. Another scholarship that's awarded uh, through one of the local businesses uh, here uh, in the Norris community is the Hausman Scholarship. The Hausman Scholarship is uh, given to a student who plans on majoring in a construction technology or construction field. Uh, it's a $1,000 uh, scholarship, and this year the recipient is Denisha Kime. Congratulations, Denisha. The next scholarship awarded through the foundation is uh, from the Dale Harlan family, a memorial to Dale. The uh, uh, scholarship is awarded to applicants who will plan on majoring in ag-related fields and attending college in Nebraska. Uh, this year, fortunately, we are able to give uh, two $500 scholarships from the Harlan Memorial Fund. This year's recipients are Daniel Oldemeyer and Carter Rohrer. Congratulations, Daniel and Carter. The next scholarship awarded through the foundation is the Lakeview Care Center Scholarship. Uh, the scholarship uh, was established by the Lakeview Nursing Home Board of Directors in 2013. The uh, Lakeview Care Center was established in 1970 and was operated as a 57-bed nursing home. It was under the direction of three area churches in Perth, Ella, and Holland. The scholarship from the uh, Lakeview Nursing Home Board of Directors honors many dedicated caregivers, volunteers, and area churches that serve those who call Lakeview their home for a time over the years. Although the facility was closed in 2012, the commitment to the community remains strong and will be carried on for many years through the endowment established to benefit youth in the Norris School District. The Lakeview Care Center Scholarship is uh, Preference is given to applicants who are entering a healthcare related field. Uh, this year's recipient of a $2,000 scholarship uh, are Aubrey Jones, Sarah Kalhoff, Paige Moshman, and Emma Severson. Congratulations to all four of you. 
The next scholarship awarded through the foundation is the Martin Scholarship. The Martin Scholarship uh, criteria include uh, academic standing and also being involved in high school athletics all four years. Um, this year's recipient of the Martin Scholarship is Grant Franken. Congratulations, Grant. The next scholarship was established very recently uh, upon the passing of Ron Severson. Um, the scholarship is $500 and priority is given to uh, a student who plans on uh, entering the field of ed education and also coaching. Uh, this year's recipient of the Ron Severson Teaching Memorial Scholarship is Gage Kirchner. Congratulations, Gage. Next scholarship is the Sergeant Christopher Swisher Scholarship. Uh, Sergeant Swisher was serving uh, in, in the Army uh, in Baghdad uh, back uh, many years ago. Uh, he was uh, tragically killed at the age of 26 fighting for freedom. Um, the recipient of this particular scholarship uh, must be in good standing academically. Uh, the $300 scholarship this year is awarded to Devin Klein. Congratulations, Devin. The last scholarship um, today uh, that we are going to be offering through the foundation is the Sam and Elaine Wilson Scholarship. Uh, Mr. Wilson was uh, one of those folks who was privileged to serve on the first Norris School Board. Uh, he was instrumental in working through the cons consolidation process way back in the 60s when Norris got its start. Uh, the $1,000 scholarship this year is awarded to Luke Whipple. That's all for me. Thanks for your patience. And uh, stay healthy. And yes, we know, it sucks. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Dudley and the Norris Schools Foundation once again for those scholarship awards. The next award is the Learn to Dream Scholarship. The Learn to Dream Scholarship was established to create an opportunity for every graduating Norris High School student to further his or her education by attending Southeast Community College in Lincoln, Milford, or Beatrice. Southeast Community College and Norris School District have partnered with the Norris Schools Foundation to offer this scholarship program. This scholarship would not be possible without the hard work and dedication of the FFA farming operation, as well as the generous contributions of Jackie Berniclau of Berniclau Educational Solutions team. The recipients, of this, of, uh, the recipients will receive tuition and fees paid up to 60 credits of tuition at Southeast Community College. This year's recipients are Samuel Portner, Denisha Kine, Edson Ortega, D'Angelo Proper, and Caleb Williams. Congratulations to those students, and thank you again to those that make it possible. I'll now turn it over to Katie Thomas, Norris High School Counselor. At this time, we'd like to recognize the seniors who have chosen to join the United States military. From the National Guard to active duty, we are so proud of your commitment to your community and to your country. You join a great tradition of servicemen and service women who have chosen to serve while pursuing education in your career. It is those traditions that make the following scholarships possible. And now we will award the local scholarships. These organizations value service and giving back to our community. They value putting others first and being a patriot. These traits were a part of the discussion in selecting this year's recipients. Recipients proved good citizenship, were leaders, have high moral standards, and have shown outstanding service to our community and our society. This year's American Legion Post number 253 scholarship is Connor Price. The American Legion Auxiliary Post number 253 scholarship is awarded to Victoria Bowden. The American Legion Post number 105 scholarship is awarded to Cadence Broderson and Denisha Kine. The next award is the Top Girl and Top Boy Award sponsored by the American Legion number 105. This award goes to the top girl and boy of the graduating class and is based on the highest qualities of good citizenship, leadership, moral character, and academic achievement. 
This year's recipients will have their name engraved on a plaque joining all the previous nominees that are displayed in our main hallway. This year's Top Girl and Top Boy Award goes to Samantha Palermo and Jacob Starr. Our next scholarship, the Cortland Lodge, number 194, goes to Macy Thomas. The Hickman Kiwanis Scholarship is awarded this year to Sydney Hobza and Taryn Tracy. The Hickman Lodge, number 256 scholarship, is awarded to Jacob Starr and J.C. Wallstrom. This year's Princeton VFW Scholarship is awarded to Connor Price. And the Hickman Area Chamber of Commerce Scholarship is awarded to Rowan Ulmer. Our next award is the Todd Garrett Cruzy Memorial Scholarship. This has been made available by Norma Cruzy in memory of her son Todd and also her husband Garrett. It was established in memory of Todd who graduated in 1983 from Norris High School. His life was taken in a tragic train accident several years after he graduated. Todd was very active in high school, especially in the areas of music, athletics, and FFA. He also had a strong faith in God, and he lived that faith out in his daily life. He had a love for music and a great talent for singing. Many of the songs he sang were a reflection of his faith. We also honor Garrett Cruzy of the Cruzy Brothers Partnership, a local farming enterprise. Garrett died at age 51 when Todd was only 13 years old in 1978. We honor Garrett Cruzy today, especially for his introduction of the center pivot irrigation system to this immediate area. Through Garrett Cruzy's strong vision, persistence, and extensive research, he enhanced the ag production here in the Firth and Lancaster County area. The main criterion for this scholarship is that the recipient displays a strong Christian commitment. The secondary criterion that is considered is involvement in music or FFA, since Todd had an interest in both of those areas. This year's recipient is Paige Moshman. The Miller Family Scholarship is sponsored by the John Miller Family. The recipient must be in the top 25% of their graduating class and plan to major in math including engineering and teaching. This year's recipient is Hunter DeVore. The Norris Association of Educators supports professional growth opportunities for teachers and is a part of the NSEA, which represents 28,000 public school educators. The NAE sponsors four scholarships at Norris annually for students who are entering a healthy profession, such as education, ministry, social work, or nursing. This year's recipients are Morgan Weiss, Chloe Bowman, Jacob Starr, and Macy Thomas. Since 2004, Nebraska Community Blood Bank Scholarship Program has been encouraging blood donations from high school students and thus ensuring a sufficient blood supply for our community. The program is designed to award scholarship funds to high schools based on the success of their blood drives. Considering how important blood donations are to our community, Please donate blood if you are able to, following our directed health measures. This year's recipients include Morgan Bice, Chloe Bowman, Grace Gutzmer, Riley Hesterman, Aubrey Jones, Denisha Kine, Gage Kircher, Paige Moshman, Sophia Miller, Taylor Petchy, Emma Severson, Julia Stevenson, and Molly Vanderham. Congratulations to those seniors. The PEO Star Scholarship. PEO is a philanthropic organization where women celebrate the advancement of women, educate women through scholarships and awards, and motivate them to achieve their highest aspirations. Samantha Palermo is this year's PEO Star Scholarship, and Kegney Ellers and Shauna Woodward are this year's alternates, also receiving a monetary scholarship. Security First Bank of Cortland Scholarship looks for a recipient that has a cumulative GPA 3.0 or higher and priority is given to a Cortland resident or a Security First Bank customer. This year's recipient is J.C. Wallstrom. The Teammate Scholarship is next. Teammates was started by Tom Osborne to impact the world by inspiring youth to reach their full potential through mentorship. 
On behalf of the Norris teammates, please consider becoming a teammate by contacting Mary Ann Frank in an intermediate building. They are especially in need of male mentors. This year's teammate scholarship goes to Caleb Honeycutt and Faley Hunter McCullery. The Thomas M. Davies Scholarship. Thomas M. Davies enlisted in the Navy just one month after his daughter was born when the attack of Pearl Harbor occurred. He served on a destroyer as the intelligence officer for two years until he was transferred back to Washington in 1944 to National Intelligence Headquarters. After the war, Thomas Davies enrolled at Harvard. Upon returning to Lincoln, he began to practice law with his grandfather and became a founding partner of the law firm Ricketts, Davies, Stewart, and Calkins, which also had a branch in the Hickman area. This scholarship was established in his great honor. This year's recipient is Christopher Richardson. At this time, we will recognize individual scholarships and awards, as well as the students who earn the top 10% of the graduating class and membership in National Honor Society. Information was gathered from the senior survey sent to students in April. Please contact Patty if you would like to add any additional scholarships or awards to be included in the graduation program. Gracelyn Adams, Grand Canyon University Dean Scholarship, GCU Priority Scholarship. Jenna Amon, Doan Presidential Scholarship, Doan Athletic Scholarship Cheer, Doan Second Visit Grant. Cade Baker, Hutchinson Community College Athletic Scholarship, Baseball. Noah Bauman, Western Nebraska Community College Academic Scholarship, WNCC Athletic Scholarship, Baseball. Lauren Bain, thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Joel Benish, Cowley Community College Athletic Scholarship, Baseball. Samuel Benny, Presidential Award. Morgan Bice, UNK Distinguished Scholarship, UNK Cooperating Scholarship, Kaylee B. Secker, National Honor Society, Gregory Blickensturfer, thank you for your service in the United States Army, Victoria Bowden, Husker Power Scholarship, William Ray Judah Scholarship, St. James PCCW Scholarship, St. James Knights of Columbus Scholarship, National Honor Society, Lanouette Beaumont, UNL Regent Scholarship, Clara Tillotson Memorial Scholarship, Kasner Scholarship, Farmers Cooperative Scholarship, Presidential Award, and National Honor Society. Chloe Bowman, Husker Power Scholarship, UNL Chancellor's Leadership Scholarship, UNL School of Music Scholarship, and National Honor Society. Elizabeth Brethauer, UNL O and K Kammerer Scholarship. Cadence Broderson, Husker Power Scholarship. Morgan Burr, Husker Tradition Scholarship, and Pauline Fahey Scholarship. Max Christensen, UNL Regent Scholarship, Principals Award, and Presidential Award. Troy Damon, UNL Regent Scholarship, Yong Ji and Lin Yi Scholarship, Anastasia Davis, Nebraska Strong Grant, NWU President Scholarship, Hugh Gi, NWU Recognition Scholarship, Honors Academy Scholarship, Learn, Serve, Earn Scholarship, Experience NWU Scholarship, NWU Campus Visit Grant, NWU Multi-Student Grant, Book Scholarship, Wesleyan Grant, and Presidential Award. Hunter DeBoer, UNL Regent Scholarship, Omaha World Herald Eastern First All Academic State Team, National Merit Scholarship, Norris FFA State Degree Scholarship, Principals Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society Secretary, and Top 10% of Class. Cagney Ehlers, Engler Entrepreneurship Scholarship, 
UNL David's Distinguished Scholarship, Pepsi Scholarship, Kasner Visit Scholarship, Principals Award, and Top 10% of Graduating Class. Sage Ellers, Husker Scholarship, Kasner Scholarship, Federal Opportunity Scholarship, Education Opportunity Scholarship, and thank you for your service in the United States Air National Guard. Zachary Ellers, Wayne State College Dean's Commitment Scholarship, Federal Opportunity Scholarship, and Education Opportunity Scholarship. Hannah Ellabrake, Husker Power Scholarship. Grant Franken, UNL O&G Camerer Scholarship. Caleb Frummy, thank you for your service in the United States Navy. Jacob Fry, Doan Legacy Scholarship, Doan Instrumental Scholarship. Quinn Galvin, Husker Tradition Scholarship. Hannah Garza, Teach Scholarship, Nebraska Association for Education of Young Children. Jerrica German, Peru State Athletic Scholarship Softball. Peru State Selfie Scholarship, Strive Scholarship, and Peru State Dean Scholarship. Grace Gutzmer, Husker Power Scholarship. Adam Hanu, thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Katie Hansen, thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Alex Heat Dirks, Nebraska Achievement Scholar Award, and UNL Chancellor's Leadership Award. Emma Held, Husker Power Scholarship. Reagan Hesterman, University of Illinois Redbird Academic Scholarship. University of Illinois In State Tuition, Presidential Award. National Honor Society, and Top 10% of Graduating Class. Riley Hesterman, UNL Regent Scholarship, Nelnet Honors Scholarship, Butheris Mazur and Love Scholarship, Principals Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, and Top 10% of Graduating Class. Sydney Hobsa, UNL Regent Scholarship, Elks Scholarship, Pauline Fahey Music Scholarship, William Ray Judah Scholarship, Principals Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, and Top 10% of Graduating Class. Lindsay Holm, thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Colton Johnson, UNL Tradition Scholarship, Karen K. Duncan Scholarship, VFW Voice of Democracy Scholarship, and National Honor Society. Aubrey Jones, Nebraska Achievement Scholarship, UNL Husker Power Scholarship, UNL Chancellor's Leadership Scholarship, and National Honor Society. Jackson Jones, UNL Husker Tradition Scholarship, H. Ball Scholarship, President Scholarship, and National Honor Society. Noah Jurgens, UNO Regent Scholarship, Real Life Academy Scholarship, Walter Scott Jr. Scholarship, Past Exalted Ruler Dan Homestead Scholarship, Principals Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, and Top 10% of Graduating Class. Sarah Koloff, NWU Black and Gold Scholarship, Nebraska Strong Grant, NWU Honors Academy Scholarship, Pre-Health Scholarship, Campus Visit Grant, and National Honor Society Philanthropy. Gage Kircher, UNL Regent Scholarship, National Honor Society. Morgan Kaler, Husker Living and Learning Scholarship, UNL David Distinguished Scholar, Pauline DeBoer Fahey Scholarship, Principals Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, Top 10% of Graduating Class. Carly Cohote, 
Peru State College Athletic Scholarship Softball. Peru State College Academic Scholarship. James Malone, Husker Power Scholarship. Thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Alex Martin, Union College Academic Merit Scholarship. Union College Personalized Scholarship. Cashel Martin, UNL Regent Scholarship, Presidential Award. Paige Moshman, SCC Academic Excellence Scholarship, National Honor Society. Grayson Meyer, Doan Athletic Scholarship, Soccer. Lucy Miller, College Bound Scholarship, UNL Merit Scholarship, UNL Husker Power Scholarship. Sophia Miller, UNO Dean Scholarship, National Honor Society President. Amy Mitchell, UNL Husker Power Scholarship, Knights of Columbus Scholarship, State FFA Degree Scholarship, Learning Lab Scholarship, National Honor Society. Ella Moeller, UNL ONG Camerer Scholarship. Grace Monson, Nebraska Strong Grant, Wesleyan President Scholarship, Learn, Serve, Earn Scholarship, Hughie Wesleyan Recognition Scholarship, Pre-Health Scholarship, Wesleyan Campus Visit Scholarship, Wesleyan Honors Academy Scholarship, Wesleyan Legacy Scholarship, Principals Award, National Honor Society. Leighton Moore, Norris FFA Farm Committee Scholarship, FFA State Degree. Katherine Moyer, Husker Tradition Scholarship. Jack Elke, Doan Athletic Scholarship, Basketball. Aiden Order, Lindenwood Academic Scholarship, Lindenwood Athletic Scholarship, Football, National Honor Society. Rowan Ulmer, UNL David Distinguished Scholarship, Rising Scholars Award, Principals Award, Presidential Award. Olivia Ozenbaugh, UNO Athletic Scholarship, Track and Field, Ohio American Legion Post No. 193 Scholarship, Ohio Sons of the American Legion Squadron No. 193 Scholarship. Samantha Palermo, Omaha World Herald Eastern First All-Academic State Team, PEO Star Scholarship, Elks James Rakers Memorial Scholarship, Whistle Memorial Scholarship, Questbridge Finalist Dartmouth College, Robert W. and Shirley T. Hadfield Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, Top 10% of Class. Daniel Palmquist, Wesleyan Strong Award, Wesleyan Board of Governors Scholarship, Hughie Wesleyan Recognition Scholarship, Wesleyan Honors Academy Scholarship, Learn, Serve, Earn Scholarship, Innovative Careers Scholarship, Wesleyan Campus Visit Scholarship. Grant Papenhagen, Fort Scott Community College Baseball Scholarship, Fort Scott Community College Academic Scholarship. Taylin Petchy, UNL Husker Power Scholarship, Girl Scouts Real Life Academy Scholarship, National Honor Society. Connor Price, UNL Regents Scholarship, Creighton Magis Award, Principals Award, Presidential Award. Kylie Reynolds, National Honor Society. Margaret Rhodes, Women of Excellence Scholarship, Dean Scholarship, Embry-Riddle Aeronautical Dean Scholarship. Christopher Richardson, UNL Regent Scholarship, Principals Award. Megan Rodriguez, thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Carter Rohr, Angler Scholarship, Husker Power Scholarship, Norris Farm Committee Scholarship, FFA Boosters Scholarship, National Honor Society. Jackson Savage, National Merit Scholar Semi-Finalist, Principals Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, Top 10% of Class. Jacob Schilling, UNL Regent Scholarship, Susan Buffett Scholarship, Zinnaker Schmidt Scholarship, Principals Award, Presidential Award, Top 10% of Class. Ethan Schmidt, Nebraska Wesleyan Strong Award, Archway Scholarship, Innovative Career Scholarship, Wesleyan Campus Visit Scholarship. Emma Severson, Hastings College McCormick Scholarship, 
Hastings College Trustee Honor Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society. Bailey Spilker, UNL Husker Power Scholarship. David Spahn, Wesleyan Strong Award, Wesleyan Black and Gold Scholarship, Wesleyan Honors Academy Scholarship, STEM Recognition Scholarship, Wesleyan Campus Visit Scholarship. Jacob Starr, North Park Nival Academic Scholarship, North Park Promise Scholarship, Elks Jack Milton Jensen, National Security Language Initiative for Youth Virtual Arabic Summer Intensive Program, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, Top 10% of Class. Julia Stevenson, UNL Regent Scholarship, Cornhusker Kiwanis Scholarship, Pauline Fahey Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society. Brandon Stolzer, thank you for your service in the United States Army National Guard. Grant Stone, Wayne State College Dean's Excellence Award Scholarship. Alyssa Suarez, UNL Nebraska Achievement Scholar Award. Hadley Susie, UNL David Distinguished Scholar, STEM Connect Scholarship, Adam Curley and Liata Schwint Scholarship, Lincoln Cornhusker Kiwanis Club Scholarship, Alternate, Telephone Pioneer Association and Museum Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society Vice President, Top 10% of Class. Hannah Susie, UNL Husker Power Scholarship. Macy Thomas, Wesleyan Nebraska Strong Grant, Wesleyan Board of Governors Scholarship, Wesleyan Honors Acad Academy Scholarships, Wesleyan Learn, Serve, Earn Scholarship, Wesleyan Campus Visit Grant, Wesleyan Book Scholarship, Girl Scout Spirit of Nebraska Real Life Academy Scholarship, National Honor Society, Top 10% of Class. Aaron Takota, UNK Loper Achievement Scholarship, UNK Special Activities Tuition, Art. Taryn Tracy, Concordia Dean Scholarship, Concordia Athletic Scholarship Basketball, National Honor Society. Tori Tucker, Doan Presidential Scholarship. Noah Van Bracklin, UNL Regent Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, Top 10% of class. Zachary Van Brocklin, UNL Regent Scholarship, UNL Athletic Scholarship Track and Field. Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society. Molly Vanderham, Concordia Academic Scholarship, Concordia Athletic Scholarship, Softball. J.C. Wallstrom, UNK Regent Scholarship, Honors Scholarship, Honors Room Scholarship, Presidential Award, National Honor Society, top 10% of class. Luke Whipple, UNL Regent Scholarship, Norris FFA Booster State Degree Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society. Paige Wilkinson, UNL Husker Power Scholarship, National Honor Society. Aaron Williams, Wesleyan Strong Award, Wesleyan Black and Gold Scholarship, Wesleyan Honors Academy Scholarship, STEM Recognition Scholarship, Wesleyan Campus Visit Scholarship, Principal's Award. Shauna Woodward, Academic Excellence, Northwest Missouri State University Bearcat Advantage, National Honor Society. Caleb Worm, thank you for your service in the United States Army. Chanacy Zeman, UNL Regent Scholarship, Leonard and Josephine Whistle Memorial Scholarship, Principal's Award, Presidential Award, National Honor Society Treasurer, Top 10% of Class. Congratulations to the Class of 2020 on your many achievements and all of our students who earned awards. Parents, grandparents, family members, and other special guests virtually present today, thank you for being a part of these students' journey that has led them to today's celebration. We know this isn't the ending you had in mind, and we are so missing you all, but are happy for the ways this experience has taught us all about resilience and overcoming obstacles, two things that will serve you well in your new adventures. Sponsors and former presenters, thank you for your continued support of the Norris community. We can't wait to see you again in person next year. 
A special thank you to Patty Wieskamp for organizing our presentation, program, and more. Thank you to Dr. Schwartz, Mr. Sagerman, Mr. Stein, and David Dudley for joining us today and for your leadership during this experience. Again, please contact Patty via email if you'd like to add any additional scholarships or awards for the graduation program. Thank you again to everyone for joining us today and congratulations seniors. <laughs>